I won't embarrass myself. Uh, no, Stalin. Yes, correct. Ah! <laughs> it smells like the money. <laughs> I mean, camera, can you focus on this nice watch as well? <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So, guys, today I'm with. <laughs> Why are you laughing, man? Go ahead, man. Today I'm with my friend Enoch. Hi, guys. You know Enoch now from your previous watch videos. So, Enoch is back again. Okay. And today it's something different. Today is an unboxing video. Yay! <laughs> so guys, hope you guys are staying safe before going to the video. Please just keep on staying safe and um, avoid getting corona. Avoid corona. Avoid corona, guys. Avoid corona. So, that just came, guys. You know, when did you place this order? Uh, I am not quite certain. I think sometime on the 15th of this month. Yeah. Yeah. Like 15th. two weeks back, actually. Yeah. Two weeks. Two weeks. Yeah. Wow, that that fast was that fast was. It came from the US, considering it's coming during the Corona period, um, lockdown and everything. It was quite fast, okay. very fast. Yeah, because a lot of extra checks are done. Um, a lot of things are done in terms of making sure people are not moving. Um, infected items across the globe. So yes. Okay. So can so you want to? Can I can I open this for you? Please go ahead and open it. I already was inside. <laughs> So he sent me a picture of the watch and it was looking stunning, man. So, yeah. uh, I sent you the link. Like a super new top, like tearing it out. I, I sent you the link where yeah. um, I bought it from. Yeah, yeah like the price it was 300 and something dollars. Like, convert that to Nera, guys. That's 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 cheap. Wait, for it, at what a century? Is it 360 or 400 or something? It was for something, actually. For something. Yeah, because, yeah. Yeah. Okay, my math brain is not really working well, but yeah. <laughs> it's over it's over hundred and twenty something. Yeah. Key kinda. Yeah, I, I don't I don't I don't check what the na equivalent is. All I do is that is an amount that I can afford and I buy it. Chicka daddy. Yes, it's it's a he watch for him. Chicka daddy. <laughs> These are your skippers now. Yeah, 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 just uh Stuff that came with it in yeah, terms yeah, of like disposed. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm more interested in the watch. Yeah. All right. So you'd have to tear. Okay, hold on, hold on. Let me get something to tear. Um, use your nails. Use your nails. You can tear. Yeah, that's keeping nails. Yeah. You need to do something about your nails, man. <laughs> can you guys see? Uh, all right. Okay. Okay. Okay, it's pronounced it. it. Pronounce that. Sorry. S T U R. I won't, I won't embarrass myself. Oh, no, Stalin. Yes, correct. It's ah! <laughs> I go <to> school! <laughs> Guys, so this is Stalin. Yes, it's a Stalin watch. So, mm. a little bit background into Stalin. Okay, is that. Okay. So, there is a guy called, I think, Max Stalin. Um, sometime in the 80s, he okay. was a Swiss watchmaker. Um, he had a couple of issues while he was making his watches and he wasn't able to continue making his watches so he passed down the watchmaking um, knowledge to his son and some couple of things happened and all that but this watch brand is uh, made by the grand I think great grandson of that great story, grandson of of Max, yes okay. of Max Stalin um, so there are two people who made this company um, you have him, I think Fisher, Henry Fisher or something, I don't really remember, and Max Stalin. So, a, there is a long history of Swiss watchmaking that um, that is attributed to this so, piece. So yeah, they have a lot of watches, quartz, automatic, mechanical, um, anything you can think about. But yeah. No, oh, that's nice. Can I, can I? Open? Yes, please. Do. <laughs> <laughs> please do. Oh, is this? I've actually seen this wow, a million times in classy. videos. <laughs> so yeah, it's so nice. The, can you perceive the, the brand new? Ah, oh, I'm high. <laughs> <laughs> it smells great, right? Really great, man. Yeah. It smells like the money. <laughs> <laughs> so guys, can you just see the class, like the elegance of the package? It smells like the money. I don't, I don't know what that is. <laughs> Okay, so how did you open this one? Are you going to show them first? Are you going to look at it first? I know they don't get 
to Kid have K that first experience. I want to. Yes, let's, let's, let's open it. Okay. Wow. Wow. <laughs> we said wow at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> wow, it's nice, man. Yeah, yeah. Come, come. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Wait, just let, let, let them see them the way oh, it's sorry. inside first. All right. You could see his branded Stalin. Wow. I'm familiar with this because I've watched the YouTube videos <laughs> a lot. So yes. It's branded? Yes. Okay. It's, it's, wow. it's, uh, you know, it's just printed on it. It's uh Stalin, if you could see it there. Okay, so um, all these cards that are there, they know them it's him. <laughs> 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 no, <laughs> that is the ATM. So let me just quick um, yeah, yeah. run you through um, because I've seen this many times in YouTube videos. So this is a let me see, this is a warranty card. If okay. I'm correct, so it comes in this little fine, nice envelope, and this is the warranty card, right? And this is the terms and condition of which you could return their watch, your watches, and all that. When you get a watch like this, you'll be able to tell. All that terms and conditions uh, I think this is just yeah a welcome message by the company you know in terms of telling you welcome to if this is your first watch they appreciate you okay. um, being a part of the yeah, welcome, brand yeah, welcome members and, all that. Mm -hmm. yeah. and this is a quick manual of the watch don't mind me I've seen this a million times <laughs> <laughs> from other YouTube channels, but I needed to do the unboxing. It's, it's an amazing experience. Now, this is the box. It's a premium um, box for the watch. I've shown you other watches that I've unboxed. This is the only one that comes. This is the first of its kind that came in this um, this packaging, and I, I sincerely love it. Okay. This holds. There is a rubber uh, band here that is holding the watch to the package. So, let's, so what's going to happen now is that. I want to take it out of okay. this and I want to have everybody see this amazing watch. So I'm going to just like run through. <laughs> it's so beautiful. <laughs> I'm so sorry. It's so beautiful. I am going to run through features of this watch. Um, at least the one I can, I can remember. So they have, okay. Um, let's start with say um, the glass of the watch. Um, Yes, so the glass is what we call Christiana. That's what they call it. It's uh, a patent um, pr uh, material by by um, Stalin um, as watchmakers. Um, okay. Yeah, that's better. I don't know if you can see. Oh, well, you can get a glimpse. It's blurry, but it's blurry. You understand? Just let. So the glass is called Christiana. Um, so we have three. I will talk about that in some other video. We have three major glass. Um, um, on, on watches, we have the um, Alciric, I've forgotten how it's really pronounced. Then we have the um, the the mineral glass, and we have the crystal um, glass, right? Um, so yes, so I mean, I think this is a blast. The best one is the crystal glass, right? Um, that's what they call it. But sometimes you can have. Um, what they call it, the glass, which is mineral glass, which mm -hmm. is normal glass, not just normal glass, but um, the special type of glass. Then they have the, um, the crystal coating on the mineral glass. So there are features that makes the mineral glass better, right? Um, the crystal glass better. So anyway, that's what you have. But here it's some sort of, I'm not really sure, but it's, it's actually lovely material. Um, from watchmakers we can call this or from watch collectors we call this christiana the fourth kind of glass on watches oh yeah so it's it's their own special um or what they call the glass on their watches so yes this is christiana Christ, uh, christiana glass on on the stolen watch i don't know if you could see maybe when he does a better shoot okay you would see it's a dual time watch i will come to the dual time the, the last time we reviewed um, a dual time watch and i'll explain how this works um this is an embossed alligator leather strap i mean it's very strong yes it's proper alligator um you could see the logo of that the are stolen wings i think that's what they call it somewhere there it's not so yeah clear. yeah i can see it you see the stolen wings there and there's an exhibition glass case at the back so it's no skeletal 
No, it's not. It's, it's it's skeletal actually. It's skeletal, so you can see here is a skeletonized watch. So you can see this, and you can see that, right? So um, it's water resistant. I think by 50 meters, if I am correct. Meaning, as far as if you are 50 meters into um, into the pool, or you dropped it in water, 50 meters down oh, okay. is water resistant up to 50 meters. Beyond 50 meters. Yo, yo. <laughs> I don't know what you would do with a watch like this beyond um, 50 meters. Now, I don't know if you've noticed this part of the watch, right? This is the crown of the watch, right? Normally, the crown is usually by, the by 3 o'clock. Then for some CQ, it's by 4 o'clock. And you know, from other watches, it is all around. This is modeled like a um, pocket watch. Right, uh, I I should tell you the name of the watch, but I'll get to that. <laughs> I'll get to that. Uh, so it's designed like a pocket watch. That's why it's the crown is on the twelve o'clock. Okay. And if you can see, it's, there's a bit of a crystal on the watch. All right, this watch is actually called the Emperor Grand DT. That's what this watch is called, meaning a watch that is fit for kings. Oh. So when they were making this watch, what was at the back of their mind? Tobit. <laughs> what was at the back at the back of their mind was they wanted to create something that was fit for royalty, in so to speak, right? Mm -hmm. So people who are avid um, watch collectors, people who want to have something that stands out that was really beautiful and i tell you this is truly a beauty um this camera is not doing justice it's not doing justice it's not doing Sorry, justice guys. to what is here but it's super i'll try and take very nice shots and include them in the video you, you need to this is super super amazing um the the specs of the watch is amazing what um the design of the watch is amazing well, am i going to be wearing this watch like around hell no <laughs> i'm not much <laughs> i'm not wearing this watch around <laughs> I'm going to have special He's locations. Yeah. <laughs> they, they will cross my hand. <laughs> well, not necessarily. Oh, well, if you are drawn, I'll play the watch. <laughs> but it's, 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 Save it's, the watch. It's, 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 really a, it's, a, it's really an amazing piece. Now, yeah. let's talk about um, the, the movement. The, the, it's, it's an automatic movement, okay. obviously. Um, because it's skeletonized, I don't know if you can see the wheel, the balance. That's the balance going back and forth somewhere there. Uh, okay. I think the camera is more focused on me. I mean, I'm very <laughs> handsome, so you have to focus on me. But I mean, camera, can you focus on this nice watch as well? <laughs> right. So you could see um, the the balance moving back and forth. So it's um, it's an automatic watch, oh, essentially. Okay. So it's not using quads. So yes, it's um, automatic moving. But yeah, a few pointers is that it doesn't have markers like one, two, three, four, five, and the rest of it. It comes without markers, right? And you can, um, if you could see well, where you are supposed to have the markers, you have stones there um, in the watch, right? Um, it's a bit bigger, I think, for four meters or something. It's a bit big, so if you have a small wrist, it may not really look good on you. But if you have a larger wrist, it will fit perfectly. You know, in this video, you're going to wear it, so we'll see how it looks like on you. Well, uh, yes, I will. Okay. But for me, I don't care if it's a small <laughs> wrist or a big wrist. I'm going to wear it out. Uh, Wrist yes. check. This is a um, Swatch um, Irony Daphina. I, I'm just putting that there. Yeah, okay. don't worry, get your watch. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so yes, that is about this watch. Now, about the dual time, to set the dual time, um, what you do is you pull it out, right, and you do your normal setting however it is you want to set it. Right now, if you want to set for the second time here on the right, all you need to do is to move anti clockwise. Okay, so once you are moving anti clockwise, you are setting the second time on the watch, but when you are moving clockwise, you are setting the first time on the watch. So the first time is the bigger dials, and the second one is the smaller dials. How is a dual time watch relevant? A dual time watch is relevant in terms if you're traveling. Like if you're very, if you're a business person, you travel a lot. You want to move from this country to that country, you know, and you want to have an idea 
um, of what the other time zone is or what the other country is, then you set your time that since I'm going to this country, I'm going to set my time to, for that country. And you're able to keep time of you know, what's happening across. Right, now to the wrist check. That is it, guys. This is the um, Emperor. Emperor Grand DT. I think the model, the model for this very one, um, was is um, nine three nine twenty. So this is the Emperor Grand DT three nine twenty. Yes. So they call it the crown jewel of your collections, of your watch collection. So yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. Okay. So. Um, I, I wanted to quickly just run through um the what they call it um Charles Houghton. the Charles Houghton. I remember the last time I was trying to explain how the dual time works and I noticed from feedback that a few people were like they weren't quite clear on how you actually set the the the, the mm -hmm. time the dual time for the Charles Houghton, mm -hmm. right? So it's very simple. Um, you could use this to move from different time zones. So once you set that here with this, this stunts, that the bezel inside, um, you'll be able to set it to, <laughs> you'll be able to set it to what time zone you want to see, right? Yeah. Now, this is just to set um, whether you want to be seeing Dubai or whatever, which is the first one, this one here. Now the ones inside these three parts, you can see the hour, the minute, and the second. To move one hour ahead you press the lower part here okay. one hour ahead so you'll be able to move the hour hand so this minute will go full one hour rotation i need to move this one by one hour so so if you're going to a country and it is like say three hours ahead you can already set it to three hours ahead of the local time of this one oh do you understand it yeah so as you're looking at this one under you can tell so this could be your source country as the country you are coming from and this one on top could be your destination country so you set it right and you already know that your source country is three hours behind and your destination country which is the one on top is three hours um. ahead of the source country so this is just for you to be able to remember what country you are setting it to and this is just for you to be able to Did they have watches back. with um, triple time or something like that? Uh, I think a number of companies have built watches like that. L let me just press this so you can see its move. I hope it shows. Um, it's not move. It's not. It's, not. it's rotating, but you can't see it. Oh, oh, Maybe oh, he, would, oh. he would do a proper recording. Let me just show you. So. So this is it, right? I press this. Hold on. Okay, sorry. So I press this. It's moving. And this one is moving an hour. Right? Okay. If I press it again, it moves ahead. And it moves up one hour. So this doesn't move? No, this is second. So it does, oh, it's okay. irrelevant because this is what you are using to set the time. So you press this. It moves one hour ahead. Right, and if you want to go back, you press the one on top, it goes back one hour. Okay, makes sense. So you could use this, like this is your, what, this is one country you are in, and this is one country you are going to. So this is how the child's protein dual time watch actually works. Let me see if, it, if you notice. If you can see this rotating. So that is how the child's protein dual time watch works. Period. <laughs> all right all right um mm. okay all right wow you know so are you planning on getting another watch ah uh, yes anytime soon <laughs> i don't know yet but there are two watches i want to get from um stalling um we have the um Turu or something like that um and there's a now the, the Turu has the um this push buttons on the top here okay and this 
by the top as well i want to get that watch um it's uh, it's a quartz watch but i think it looks like a mechanical watch i don't i have not really really reviewed it but i just love the design i want to get the blue color as well then the second watch i want to get is from Stolen as well it has double barrel double balance um i like the way the double balance ticks double balance. Uh, so the balance of um just one second so this is a balance this thing rotating so imagine you have this thing this balance this engine rotating one here and one here okay right that's 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 what the watch is but does it does it help the watch in any way and it's just fancy not not necessarily fancy it's just nice like see we collect these watches because of the design and to imagine you have a watch that yeah. works based on the principle of double balance it's just crazy so yeah. Okay, so that's, that's, cool. that's what I'm collecting. So, um, ordering from Amazon was there any um I, I, any issue at all? I ordered directly from Stolen. Oh, they from Stolen. I ordered directly from Stolen. That's the beautiful thing. I get free shipping from or ordering from Stolen. So most of that companies, if I ordered from them, apart from the amount I paid for the watch, I probably would have paid an extra yeah 40, 30, 40 dollars for shipping. But I paid exactly the amount for the watch, and I got the watch without extra cost on shipping. Oh, this deal that's that's so dope that's so dope yeah uh <laughs> not <of> questions <laughs> <laughs> yeah um, i wanted to get this this watch it's a, a t- automatic watch by cq it's uh the cq um paddy i think that's what it's called the nickname for the watch is called the toto right toto yes the okay. toto yeah so that one has the the crown by the four clock and it's not really like uh it's not really like one big luxury watch or one big fancy amazing watch it's a great watch but it's a rugged watch right so that's why i want to get it i want to get and um, perhaps i retire all these other watches i'm wearing mm. and use that a lot more um it's is it 200 meters dive watch meaning i can walk around in the rain with the watch i could go swim in the watch i could do a lot more um with the watch it's a diver's watch so to speak so yes i'm thinking about collecting or getting a cq um automatic paddy yeah. that's it honestly i don't understand this um 50 meters 200 meters is still the same water now or is it the pressure the water pressure the deeper you go into water the higher the pressure okay so they are telling you that this watch at 50 meters it can contain or it can make it can bear that much pressure at 50 meters the deeper you take your watch the more pressure that is applied to, to the watch and the more the possibility of the watch, the watch being damaged or okay. um, the w- damaged by say water sinking or seeping into the watch because there is higher pressure on, on the watches and that's also why some people can like if you're not a professional diver you yeah, can yeah. dive to a certain depth into the water right because um, your lungs are not prepared for it it's there's so much pressure on your lungs and all that and even if you are wearing oxygen masks and everything if your body has not been built from practice and everything it's going to damage your body and that's very applicable to watches as well well yeah thank you for enlightening me <laughs> 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 yes to hear the old stuff i was like ha, what a resistance so what's what's the difference man <laughs> that's a big difference <laughs> okay that's dope okay so guys <laughs> I think we still like 10 minutes or more probably by more. now. Yeah, yeah, more. <laughs> so um guys thanks for watching. Thank you enough for being on my channel once more. Okay. And I it's know consequently pleasure. you will come again. I, I think when, when the new orders come or when you have any um, new um, <laughs> watch idea really to share with us. Yeah, I think <laughs> I want to talk about the glasses. Um the, the glass that makes oh, the those, three types the, of glasses. Yeah, the say. three types of glasses. Um crystal crystal glasses basically um i always a watch with a crystal glass are usually more expensive that's a fact um mm-hmm. but we get into that some other time um yeah so yeah and perhaps when i get another watch very soon watch out what do you guys think i should get next okay let's start with that watch 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 yeah what exactly. watch <laughs> do you think i should buy next maybe we could buy it and we could review it on this channel not not you i'm not i'm not interested um, in i'm trying to think safe like i'm trying to know that i know or, watch names or you could go to stalling right go to stalling don't pick any of the top million watches but go to stalling 
um, stolen.com or something. He'll put the link on, on the video. Description. Anyway. Yes, and tell me what you think I should get next. And we could get it, we could get it, and we could review um, the watch. And yeah, let's see how it goes. And would you buy the Emperor Grand DT? Yeah. Would you buy it? And if you would buy it, where would you wait? And again, do you I'm think the price is too much for it? Oh, actually, I'm sorry. Um, the price was at two ninety five dollars, but the actual price of the watch is about one thousand four hundred and something dollars. So I got it as a steal. Uh, you, you go check the website; it's there. Wait, initially in the video, oh, good. in the video beginning, we said um this thing, but we said I said three hundred. Yes, it's five hundred. It's five dollars short at two ninety five dollars. Oh, oh, okay, 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 okay. Yeah, it's correct. I bought it for two ninety five directly from the stolen site but the actual price on the stolen site is two is one thousand four hundred and something dollars it's there mm. on the stolen site you can check it it's called the manufacturer um recommended selling price mrsp mrsp yes manufacturer recommended, recommended selling, selling price. price so that price is the one thousand four hundred and something dollars but i got it for those yeah dollars. guys <laughs> <laughs> oh that's so cool that's so cool that's so cool um enoch is there any other thing or are we Stephanie? Stephanie? that's it just tell me if you would get the watch Comment. yeah just tell me if you get the watch um where would you wear it to exactly is it too expensive for the amount i mean give it just, just fancy tell for you. time yes <laughs> then also tell me if you think we should get another watch going to the stolen sites tell me what you think we should buy let's review that watch or if you have somewhere else you think we should review any watch Let's look at it and let's see if we can review it. Yeah, guys. That's thanks for watching. Me. Please subscribe, like, comment, and smash, share, guys. Smash the subscribe smash button. It. <laughs> smash it. Like, press them very hard. <laughs> it's a pleasure being with you. Yeah, man. This is the third part. So, there might be a fourth to run, run out of fingers to count. <laughs> see ya. Peace out. Bye bye. I used to smile. You cannot cut it. I do. <laughs> <laughs>